The first public notice that was ever made of Shakespeare was from a Grub Street writer, Robert Greene, who called him an upstart crow, beautified with our feathers. In the book, in the book, under that title on the board. Is the beautified feather thing because Green knew that Shakespeare was the Earl of Oxford? Absolutely not. <laughs> not even close. I, the Earl of Oxford published poetry, OK? And it wasn't any good. I mean, had Oxford been able to get a play put on, he would have broken a leg to do it. I mean, can you think of any human being that would, for any reason, not put his name on Hamlet? The Oxfordian thing, the anti-Stratfordian thing. What pisses people off about Shakespeare? What lies behind every controversy about Shakespeare is rage. Rage over the nature and unequal distribution of talent. Rage that genius appears where it appears for no material reason at all. Desiring a thing cannot make you have it. Now, the trouble with writing, if I may bring it up here in the English department, <laughs> as we all do a little of it from time to time, writing, and some of us start to think delusionally, maybe with a little time, a little peace, a little money in the bank, you get that room of your own, you think, well, shit, I might be a writer too. I mean, we accept genius in sports as something we cannot do, but it's no more likely that you could be a writer that you could be, what, an Olympic pole vaulter? Because what you have to be before you try to be a pole vaulter, hello, is a pole vaulter, no? <laughs> yeah. You are one. A pole vaulter? A novelist. No, I am not. For me to be a novelist, I would have to make a deal with myself that it was OK being a mediocrity in a profession that died commercially in the last century. All right, people do that. I am not one of them. If you take away nothing else from my class, from this experience, let it be this. If you're not a genius, don't bother. All right, the world needs plenty of electricians and a lot of them are happy. I'll be fucked if I'll be a mid-list novelist getting good reviews from the people I give good reviews to.